what's good everyone matt here with another nmb theater vlog for uh september the 28th 2024 and uh today i saw b2 rounding out the namba flush which is where you watch team n team m and b2 all in the same week that's called a namba flush it's not a real name but i made it up i'm calling it here now so your challenge next time you come to japan or you are already in japan Try to do a Namba flush. Try to see all the teams um, in the same week or in the same trip, rather. Um, but yeah, so today yeah we watched uh, B2. So I was here for uh, Misaki and uh, Wakapon. I was more excited to see uh, Wakapon today because uh, I finally got a chance to uh, bring my uh, Final Fantasy VII Buster Sword pen lights. These are so dumb, <laughs> but they're really fun and really cool. Uh, I got these. Got, these are from the uh, Final Fantasy concert they had uh, earlier. They had a beginning of September over here in Osaka. And actually, shout out to Yin for helping me get these uh, pin lights. Uh, he actually went to the concert, and I gave him money to go buy the goods because they were right behind the ticket counter. But yeah, anyway, so yeah, I finally got to use these. They're really heavy. They're really bulky. Um, I don't recommend using them like for a long time because your wrists will get tired from waving them a lot. Uh, but yeah, uh, so I had those set to walk upon with uh, two whites. It's kind of weird because then it shows like the materials as like other pin light colors on there too. So it's like two greens makes a white. I don't, know, it, I don't get it. But yeah, and then I had my Pete Misaki pin lights uh, set up as well. So yeah, it was uh, very fun. Again, right off the bat, uh, when the concert, st when the show started, uh, uh, Wakapon saw like my big, dumb, bulky pin lights. <laughs> kind of smile at those. So that was good. And then, yeah, uh, but yeah, also yeah, today I was in the uh, fifth row, just off center left. So very good seat, ticket number 137. So yeah, uh, very good seat uh, today. Pretty much as, as good as you can get if you're not going to be in the very front row. Um, definitely a very good position because you're at good eye level with the members so they can see you clearly. And he adds a pretty good view, clear view. There was this like really like old short guy like sitting in front of me and he was like sleeping during like the like halfway, like the back half of the con of the show. It was kind of funny. Um, but yeah. Uh, yeah, B2, yeah, I've seen this a few times now. You know, it's, it's a very energetic, kind of tiring, exhausting uh, show. A lot of upbeat songs. Uh, but you know, really fun. I really like the uh, the set list for this um, very much. Uh, I obviously did uh, my dumb little gimmick during uh, the fourth song, which is uh, sunglasses at Uchikake Banashi, uh, where I put on my sunglasses. Misaki saw that and she was like laughing <laughs> during <laughs> during the song while I was like while I was doing it. So that was good. That's guess my my goal is just to get some reaction out of the members. Like, why does random guy have sunglasses during the sunglass song? Oh, okay. So anyway, that was, that was a fun, uh, dumb little moment. For the unit, so uh, Jukron, uh, it was uh, Risa, Risa Chan. So I went with her with that. Um, and then uh, so today was Misaki, of course. Wimbledon, I went double duty. I went with Aya, Pion, and uh, Wakatan for that. And then Love Ash, I was uh, Wakapon for that. So you know, kind of the usual. I think Love Ash is definitely like the most boring of the uh, the, the unit songs for B2. And then uh, next MC they had was like kind of like, was how did you change you know recently or have you evolved? So I guess uh, yeah Misaki I guess she cut her hair like last night, and uh, I, I I noticed her hair was a little different today. So yeah, apparently uh, Kato was like wait wasn't your hair longer yesterday? So <laughs> it was like a very sudden like uh, haircut change. It was it's not very short, but I think she like, kind of cut layers off of it, so it's a bit thinner looking. But you know kind of and not as long as before. She, she didn't go full bob yet like everyone else is going, but. Um, it, it, it's, it's nice for her. Shin Shin has been going to lunch with like uh, some members. Like she went with went out to the lunch with uh, Yayoi, and I guess uh, Mighty found out, and then Mighty's like, "Oh, so you threw me away because you're not on Team In anymore, so we can't hang out anymore." <laughs> and then I guess uh, she also uh, Shin Shin went out with uh, Tenna, and I guess Raypon got jealous, and she wanted to go out with Shin Shin. So you know, she's just been really popular with the, the members here. Um, yeah, and then yeah, the back half of the set list is pretty good. You know, as usual. Uh, the, you know, the Rakadaze is the best way to kind of end out that uh, block. Uh, but yeah, that was uh, the uh, the B2 show, yeah, you know. Um, yeah. yeah, it's all right. Uh, people are still trying to do like the weird like fuckboy uh, calls during the uh, Wimbledon. Um, it's like only like one guy, a couple people trying to do it, and then like one like really loud, uh, I think it was Ayapion fan was like trying to do like the extra calls or that, so. But it's still funny that most people kind of like rejected it, like, you know, they aren't doing what the the members want them to do so yeah that's good uh yeah and then uh, for the uh, most important part of the uh show the miyokuri so yeah i prepared uh two things for the uh the sketchbook for cement for uh, wakapon and uh misaki so 
So uh, Misaki was uh, last. Well, I'll get to her last. Uh, Wakapon was second in line, so I showed her sketchbook. So I showed her the, the pen light. She knows already. And then I, I wrote her the message. Oh, I got this from the Final Fantasy VII concert. And she was really jealous. She's like, oh, you know. <laughs> so uh, that was good. And then um, yeah, the rest of the members, like, I was getting like kind of like, I was trying to like show, like, oh, look at my cool pen light. I didn't really care for it. I didn't really care. Uh, they like my hat here. I bought this new hat today. It's, uh, it's the Bruno Mars Don Quixote hat. Um, just got it because there's like a Bruno Mars collaboration of goods. I saw this like being advertised, like, oh, yellow hat. Okay, I'll get that. I don't care if it's, I don't really listen to Bruno Mars, but I do go to Don Quixote, so it's kind of dumb. Uh, so they saw that. They thought that was a funny thing. Uh, yeah, and then, yeah, for uh, Misaki, uh, so I showed her the sketchbook and uh, I was like, I wrote, uh, uh, what was the best part about Estonia? <laughs> I try and want to go to the next level because I said, uh, how was Estonia? She always said, oh, it was amazing. So I tried to ask her, what was the best part about Estonia? Because she went to Estonia like last week, just randomly for like a week or so or a few days. Uh, and she like, tried to think about it really hard, but like, you only had like two seconds, right? And she's like, uh, everything. And then I laughed at her. So that's all right. But yeah, that's going to do it for uh, the uh, B2 show. So yeah, I completed out the uh, Namba Flush this week. I see all the shows. Very busy week. A lot of shows, a lot of events. Uh, yeah, so I guess uh, next time I'll be checking in will be uh, for the 14th anniversary concert. So um, look forward to that. Um, let me know in the comment section what's your favorite uh, Bruno Mars uh, song, and uh, I will read those comments. It's unrelated to NMB, but it's, uh, it's related to his video and uh, Don Quixote, which is like right above the theater. Uh, but yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, share the video, leave a comment, all that stuff, and I'll see y'all later. Peace.